guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel this is your girl Mary smart kenya in case you're new here please please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to click on that notification bell so that anytime i post any new video will be among the first people to be notified and to my returning family thank you so much and welcome back to this channel to my new subscribers thank you so much guys for choosing to join this family and welcome to this family to my premier gang thank you so much guys for always being here i really appreciate you and welcome back to this channel so now i want to head out and i decided because i might vlog out there i decided to do the intro instead of doing the intro after i am back to buy some few stuff in fact the main reason why i'm going it's because we are we have some books that i need to go and get for alex and i notice his school his sport shoes um in appeal i don't know why no original but they are appealing so it's okay so now i want to go out here is my list some very few items but i have to go out because of the books and then oh i decided from yesterday okay, i don't know who's there's somebody who's banging i don't know what they are doing so i decided from yesterday i'm officially starting my weight loss journey sina haraka so um it's a day at a time a step at a time so um i'm starting from 3 p.m i won't be taking any carbohydrates i'll be taking just salads and fruits yes and then the the cut thing of mine this this i've been swinging my waist so i want like i give myself like a month and then i can tell you whether it's working or not because they said if you're very consistent each day you take at least 15 minutes but personally i'm taking 30 minutes swinging my waist with this so today was my second day so i want to be as consistent as possible so that i can be able to see results because even if you have the best best gadgets you have the best equipment but yet you're not consistent mm -mm. nothing is going to work so i want to submit hey for the first time <laughs> for the first time i want to submit my outfit of the day but they, why am I doing that? Okay, I have a cap on because out there it's very, very hot. They applied sunscreen, but I decided I want to have this. And then I have my branded t-shirt. Okay, because I'm using the front camera, it's written Facts Delicacies. This is my business page. Kindly, if you haven't followed me on Instagram and Facebook, kindly go and check my business page. It's Facts Delicacies. I bake cake. So if you're in Akuru and you need a cake, can you let me know? And then I have this uh, rugged blue jeans. And for the shoes, I have these black sport shoes. So now let's go to the shopping and then we'll see you when I'm back. Good news. I am the cabinet secretary uh -huh. for the person who's for sports, uh -huh. gender, uh -huh. and yes, and uh -huh. entertainment. Wait, wait. Yeah, 50 and something votes. Saka Zako Nigani? I give him some ideas. Oh, ideas for? Well, you give Nani ideas? The cabinet, the person. <gasps> okay, well, we'll move to our happy daughter school, Levi. Uh huh. Nona. Uh huh. Papa and a factual one, Nanny, Donafakua, Nanny, eh? Secretary, where's I when in Secretary, when Secretary, Secretary, one, Apa the Mutuana stand for sports, gender, and entertainment. Oh, nice. Uli Uli selection at Chama? Apa to Charles Saman to an a fox, yeah, Donafak select. Nani, so I didn't select me. Who is that? Who is that? Nani, Nani, when you are minister, Jeremy, the minister. And come say, dear, my boy, Jeremy, you live on the corner. I guess it. Mom, my mom, my mom, my 
nimepata 50 something votes by the time tumeanza. Oh, wewe nilikuwa campaign campaign master wake. Ngoja mlianza aje, mlifanya campaign. Hapa hapa ticha hapa alikuwa anaangalia hapa watu nini hapa wanafaa kufanya kufanya aje jisquele. Lazima watu wanataka ku campaign. Sawa ul campaign. Unaona? Mhm. Aka students wao wanachagua na nani ndio wanafaa kuwa campaign man wao. So wewe ndio kwa campaign man wa Jeremy. Yes. Alafu. Alafu. Eh. Ah, oh, ni msaidia sana. Akapata votes. Eh, kesho ndio tutaona nani ndio nyingine. Ah, ni hivyo si amevote, ameshinda? Sisi hata tujui nani ameshinda tu. Na mbona umeniambia wewe ni secretary? Eh, Jumendo nimeshinda secretary. Ako na bodyguard wawili. Goja. So mimi nimbe kisha na mapato ya results. Eh, nani ndo ameshinda? So mimi Na sasa unapata results na already ushachaguliwa. Nuna ni good news. Jenda. Mhm. Hapa na nini entertainment. Yeye ndo ameshinda. Jeremy. Inaka yes like. Inaka yes ama ameshinda. Ina tumeshinda. Umejuaje umeshinda na jamaa na votes bado. Sio ni rigi. Ni jubai kesho tutajuizo votes. Mhm. Ume, umeshinda. Umeonea wapi? Niliona hivi. Sinizi votes ni mingi sana na kuliko watu wengi. So sisi ndio tutashinda kwa hiyo sports. Na msiposhinda. Itabidi tugoje next year. <laughs> Kuna mpaka gavana? Eh ni president. Sa president ni nani? Ari atujui. Wa class? Ah ah, the for the whole school kama ndo ku in charge. Ku take care of the school. And then the ministers? Ministers. Kama hao wanasaidia hapa deputy president au president hapa anafaa kuwasaidia for your solutions za kama vitu nzuri za kusaidia shule kama sports, entertainment na agenda. Hapa. Na wewe sasa mbona ukusimama uvotiwe? Lazima uvusaidie watu wengine kuvotiwa. Ama you don't want to be a leader? Ni kuwe leader uh-huh. ni kuwa next year. Na Jeremy Sondra sin. Uh-huh. Na mbona si mwaka? Mhm. Uh-huh. Ndio ndio kwa na karibu ni single game garage. uniform and then nataka kujipanga niende jumuiya. Sawa. Bye. Ah. Hey, I'm back home and I wanted to show you what I got. It was more of a fruit shopping. I just got some very few items that I, I needed to refill. But I didn't go to the main market that I go to. So I didn't buy a lot of fruits because eh, that market was so expensive. And then I got some mangoes. We are taking advantage of the mango season. So we can't let it slide. We have to eat mangoes. And then we have some sweet melon. We have some grapes here. And then I have some apples and some plums. And then I got some meat because we don't have any. Uh, this is the main reason that had took me there. I wanted to buy some sport shoes for Alex. Personally, I prefer um, thrifted because they have really nice designs and the material as well at a very fair price. So I got this from a certain guy in town. And then I got some just in And then I got Uh, I got a chicken from Personally I don't like broilers but I want to practice more on baking the chicken and this one was on offer AKG was going for I, I think to three something that's why I got it and then I got um, some cheese in this house we really really love cheese This one is for, is for sandwich. I took one for sandwich and um, 
these are for burgers these two are for burgers each was going for 300 and they usually go for 400 bob per pack and then i got some caster sugar i don't like being without caster sugar and then i got this this is what i went to buy i really love this uh because alex does his shoes so I'm no kit act me in Guinea and a chafonga yumba sana. So I prefer this for his kiwi. And then I got some yogurt. <laughs> I can need to mix my own yogurt. Mm -hmm. And then I got some some freezing flour. I usually get this. Oh, and then I got let me show you. I got a uh, Okay, the main thing that took me to town that I had to go personally is this textbook. And what I love about where I buy my books, they cover for you for free. This is what you needed in school. This is what took me to, to town today. I wanted to buy some fruits from my list. I wanted to buy some fruits. And then instead of the chicken, I wanted some chicken nuggets. I saw some somebody preparing chicken nuggets. And she said they were so yummy, so I wanted to try them out, but I didn't get any. Because there's some money that I went to, and then I got some meat. Okay, the main, the main thing that I wanted are uh, fruit. In fact, I didn't go anything beyond my budget, apart from hmm, this. Today is Tuesday. So anytime I go to town and it's on Tuesday, I usually buy, because you buy one pizza and you get one free. I got chicken mixed with um, mushrooms and this other one it's chicken it's a, we really love chicken so that's why we got this and in this house pizza it's bay so we just felt like eating from outside today I was so tired I don't know why I'm so tired and I'm, I don't feel like being anything so that's what I got See the blue sky, feel the wind that blows. Get the rush in. When washing the vegetables, I only add uh, clean water and some vinegar to wash my vegetables and fruits. Next, I'm making some fruit salad and I'm chopping some uh, apples, mangoes, grapes, sweet melon, and then I'm going to be adding some thin melon. Love. 
love's for beginners Ain't no witness It slips through your fingers I ain't telling no lies So F all the drama F the karma Just do what you wanna Promise you you got time Leave you And keep looking forward Don't you look backwards And you'll be fine Come through And say what you need to Don't let them put you down I have just added some yogurt and now I'm sprinkling some chia seeds so that it can be more nutritious and very yummy. Alex will be having a pizza and the fruit. So that is dinner. This is Alex's dinner. This is my dinner because I've decided to be very strict on dieting and also on my exercise so that uh, my target is 10 kgs in uh, till December. So help me God. So so that's our dinner, our simple dinner. So let us and go and enjoy our meal. so that I can boil and then store in the fridge and freezer because I don't like storing raw meat in the fridge. I don't know why. Uh, the, the only meat that I can store in the fridge when it's raw it's either marinated chicken, um, fish, uh, yes. Those are the only things that I store in the fridge when they are still raw. It, when it comes to meat. using some spring onions you can either use spring or red onions just to add that extra flavor For the spices I've just added paprika and then I'm going to be using salt to taste uh, black pepper beef masala garam masala uh, rosemary turmeric cubes and uh, some ginger and garlic everything I'm going to be putting in in like a, a quarter teaspoon and this is two kgs so that it doesn't like be too much spices personally i don't prefer cooking uh, or frying my food with spices nowadays because my ulcers uh, they're not giving me peace so i prefer boiling with spices but when i'm frying i only use cube and black pepper Try boiling your beef or your chicken or any other food that you boil, or you pre-boil using uh, the spices and salt and blah 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 and everything. Trust you, you're going to love it because the spices get into the meat and when you're cooking, the, the spices are well balanced from the soup to the meat. But when you boil without uh, the spices, when you fry, you find that your... 
the the sweetness koko tu kwa ni ni peke yake. Now I want us to marinate our chicken and our veal, turmeric, our crushed uh, crushed cubes, paprika, black pepper, ginger, uh, rosemary, and chicken masala. And then I'm going to be adding. Oh, and then I also added ginger and garlic paste. And then I'm going to be adding some lemon juice and some cooking oil. Not much. And then I'm going to mix everything and all the spices. My rub is ready. I'm tapping with a serviette because I don't have a kitchen paper towel. Because um, I just washed the chicken and I don't want excess moisture. That's why I'm, I'm tapping, tapping. And then after that, because I'm not cooking today, I'm going to be like poking the chicken so that the spices can get in. I'm just using a normal fork. Would you stay till the morning light? Or would you follow me? Or would you let it be? If I leave tonight, we could do this right. We'll find the remedy. Or would you stay with me now till the morning light? The main reason I was poking or creating some small, small holes so that the spices can penetrate through. Just want you to know that I didn't throw your stuff away Before you make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find I'm standing right here I know that I told you I'm going to be wrapping this and then put in the freezer because I'm not sure when I'm going to be cooking the chicken but if I knew, if it was tomorrow or the day after tomorrow, I could just put it in the normal fridge compartment. But because I'm not sure, I'm going to be putting in the freezer. So by the time uh, I'm going to be using this, it's going to be well marinated. As for the beef, I'm waiting for it to cool so that I can pack in tins and then put it in the fridge for future use. Uh, so now guys, we've come to the end of the video. Thank you so much for spending my day with me. Thank you so much for your support. If you have not subscribed to this channel, please, please, please subscribe to this channel. It shows that 70% uh, have not subscribed to my channel that consume my content. Please, if you know you consume my content and you have not subscribed, please subscribe to this channel. It's free of charge. It really helps the channel to grow. And please make sure you like this video, share it widely, and leave a nice comment. And please make sure you tell a friend, tell a friend to subscribe to this channel. Until next time, bye bye. I swear that I'm sober, just listen.